Pleasant. I'm the Vice President of Design and Engineering here at SeaWorld Orlando, and I'm joined with Tim Shea, President of Premier Rides, and we're here to uh, talk to you about Icebreaker. So Icebreaker is SeaWorld's sixth roller coaster here in Orlando, and it is our first launch roller coaster. It's not just any launch roller coaster. It is a quadruple launch coaster with four launches on the layout. We're going to start with a unique horizontal switch track, we'll bring you over onto the launch track and allow us to run two trains. We'll start with a backwards launch up Florida's steepest beyond vertical drop, a 93 foot tall spike that's tilted at 100 degrees. That's beyond vertical. And after that, the fun's just getting started with three more launches. We're going to go forwards, backwards, and forwards once more up to a top speed of 52 miles an hour as we go over an 80 foot tall twisted top hat element. And the launch track itself is special because we have an airtime hill on either side, so you're going to get airtime on every hit of that launch. That totals to 16 hits of airtime throughout the entire layout, so it's going to be a really exciting ride keeping you out of your seat almost as much as you're in it. Once you clear that top hat, there's low to the ground twists, turns, airtime hills, and all sorts of excitement along 2,750 feet of travel distance. Now it's a really exciting ride, but it's also a family-friendly ride. With a 48-inch tall rider height requirement, it means the entire family can come along and ride with you. So SeaWorld is also proud to partner with the Alaska Sea Life Center. Alaska Sea Life Center is the premier facility in Alaska that specializes in rescue, rehabilitation, education, and research. And we're very excited to partner with this, this incredible organization. Now we are hard at work on Icebreaker out of the park. Actually just yesterday we topped off the 93 foot tall Beyond Vertical Spike. So it's coming together. There's lots of bright orange track to go look at if you go visit our park. So we are hoping you will join us in the spring of 2020 as we break the ice with Icebreaker. But today, you know what we're all here for is to see the ride vehicle. The ride vehicle that you're going to be riding on here in the spring on Icebreaker. But before we do that, I'm going to turn it over to Mr. Jim Shea to uh, say a few words. Jim? We are very, very excited, very honored. Premier Rides just loves working with SeaWorld. This is our fifth project in a row. And this ride is going to be so awesome. It is going to be so awesome. You hit on all those accolades, the 16 air times. It's got bank angles beyond 90 degrees. And you actually go over 3,000 feet on the track because of the multiple launches. So that's, that's really fantastic. It's got, we've got the rider height at 48 inches. So that's going to be awesome for families. So we are so, so excited for this. And uh, unveiling the, your, new, your new coach. Is, is a big deal for us. So let's let's just do it. Hello, I'm Brian Andralzik, Vice President of Design and Engineering for SeaWorld Orlando. We're here at the IAPA show floor at Premier Rides booth showing off Icebreaker. Earlier today we revealed the coaster train that you'll be riding on on this coaster and we're very excited to bring SeaWorld Orlando's first launch roller coaster to you in the spring of 2020. Icebreaker will be SeaWorld's sixth roller coaster and it's not only a launch coaster, it's a quad launch coaster with four separate launches uh, including a backwards launch up Florida's steepest beyond vertical drop, a 93 foot tall spike that's tilted at 100 degrees. 